Um, hello everyone. In this video, I will show how to create a Windows server uh, by using the um, Quick Labs um, in the Google for the uh, GCP Google Cloud. Um, so these are the instructions. So you can just follow this. And so here in this one uh, in this video, I will be using uh, Sandbox, which is uh, Windows Server 2016, and open the Google Chrome. I opened that already. And this is the Google quicklabs.com. And I logged in as my uh, student uh, user users. So here uh, I have some credits shared with me already. And here in another lab, I open this link and this link you can get that from um, here, which is this one. OK, so uh, I recommend that before you click the start lab button, read the instructions carefully. So here um, so these are the instructions. Just uh, follow these instructions here. OK, and after you are ready, you click on the start lab button and then it says launch with one credit. Yes, I select this and then it takes a few seconds until it is ready. OK, now uh, click on the open Google console. And here, uh, don't use this one. So this uh, this is left from the previous one and just come here and then username. So this is a email address. Click on this one. So to copy into the clipboard and then right click and paste next for the username. Uh, so for the password, this password, click here, copy it, and then paste. OK, so here, this is the password that we just copied from here. Do not use your personal username, uh, no, email address and password. Next. OK, so here, don't save it because this is temporary. And here, click on navigation menu right here. And here, uh, under the compute, let me scroll down a little bit. Under the com compute, we have compute engine and then click on VM instances. OK. Um, and then here it says create instance. I click on create instance. OK, for the name, uh, use your initials. So like ABC, like this. So first name, middle and last initials. Uh, in my case, it will be Bilal Gonen, BG. OK, BG. And region, leave it as it is. US Central 1 and US Central 1A. So just leave them as it is. And for the series, select N1. OK. and and so boot disk, so it says Debian. We want to select Windows Server for this project, which is this one, Windows Server. And Windows 2012 R2 Data Center, this one. OK, R2 Data Center, select. And what else? Just leave everything as it is, create. So this takes a few seconds. And then uh, the instruction says, um, OK, so here, if you look at the instructions, OK, so here, uh, let me see the progress, not this one. OK, so that should be ready in in a second. Yes, so it is ready. So in here, I can click on check my progress. And OK, it says uh, the instance BG1. So it detects that. And then this part is completed. Now activate Cloud Shell at the top right here. OK, and then here uh, we can just put a few comments. Uh, comments, for, for example, 
G Cloud Art List. So let me click on here. And then let me just paste it. Okay. And then press enter. All right. So th that is good. So this is the username. And what else? Um, here, uh, remote desktop into Windows Server. Okay. Um, so there are a few ways. So let me just select this to see if it is ready. And here, let me just paste it. And of course, it, it is not instance one. So it will be BG one. Okay, BG one. And so it says, did you mean zone east one? No, uh, this will be no, because remember it was central. So here we will say N, no. And let me look at this. So it is not ready yet. So it, it takes maybe one minute or maybe less than one minute. So let me uh, press up key uh, to see if it is ready. No. It looks like it is ready. Let me see. Yes, so here it says activation successful. Right here. I don't know if you can see that. If I scroll down, scroll up a little bit, instance setup finished. So this is ready to use. Now here I click on the start button and remote desktop connection. And the, we use the external IP, which is here, 130, 130, 211, 211, 121, 121, 167. Okay, and this is the port number. Uh, I think it says somewhere here. Oh, okay. What happened here? Okay, so this matches connect and username. So let me go back to here. Let me say set Windows password. So let me just admin set. And also let me go back to here, username, admin, password. Let me click on here, copy. Okay, I can um, close this. Let me come back to here, password. Um, so I have to type. Uh, let me see. Set Windows password. admin set okay so i have to type this p so this one okay okay so it works it says uh, here yes click yes maximize it and in here click yes and i can close the um, server manager from here and then in here let me just click um, so let me say Bilal Gonan and then um, greetings from Bilal Gonan I guess the, um, the assignment says type and yes this uh, virtual machine was created in google cloud platform so you just do that uh, i guess that's all and um, have a nice day